Hi, I'm Joe Buffoni, the Chief Officer of the Country Fire Authority. CFA is an amazing organisation and we achieve amazing things together. So all of us should stand proud in what you achieve and I'm asking you to support me to continue to be proud and to serve the community. I wanted to take this opportunity to thank each and every one of you for your efforts and your support and the terrific work that you've done over the last five weeks. We've had an incredibly busy time with some really complex and long duration jobs. Some of the examples are the Portland Ship Fire, which was 15 days duration. We had the Strathdowney Peat Fire, which was 40 days duration. We had the Summerton Tip Fire, uh, which was 10 days in duration. And then we had the South Australia deployment where we had 200 personnel go over to support our neighbours in a time of need. That is a massive effort on behalf of CFA and we've worked very, very closely with our other emergency management partners. So I wanted to say in particular to our frontline firefighters, to all of our frontline firefighters, thank you for your work and thank you for your efforts. It's really appreciated. I also wanted to acknowledge our support personnel. Um, you play a critical role in supporting operations and I know that um, you actually give up your expertise, your time, and I appreciate the flexibility, the expertise that you bring to those roles. And I encourage you to continue to do that, but also say thanks. I'm also asking the managers of CFA to support the release of our support staff into those roles. They play a critical role in supporting our operations and I understand that you have business continuity that must continue, but your support is really appreciated. All the indicators are showing us that we've got a tough summer ahead. El Nino is very is positive. We have a um, strong Indian Ocean dipole. Our underpinning dryness is similar to those of the mid-2000s. And the fire behaviour that we've seen recently is without a doubt um, quite significant. And we're just starting summer. So I'm asking you all to be focused on the summer ahead. I'm asking you to be focused on our priorities of issuing warnings and information to the community of first attack being aggressive and protecting life and property with determination, but I'm also asking you to make sure that you're absolutely safe in doing that. So again, to all of you, thank you for your support, be safe, and I'm wishing you all a safe and Merry Christmas.